Hey folks, this is Chandler Anderson, the owner of the Right Care Clinics, the walk-in clinic and the primary care clinic. In 2020, my staff ran headfirst into the COVID storm. When many offices were closing and not accepting patients, we not only kept open and continued to see our patients, we actually went to patients' homes to help take care of them, to make sure that they got the right care. Many mornings we left home not knowing if we would return. We didn't know a lot about COVID as far as how it would affect healthcare workers. We didn't know a lot about COVID period, but because we care about our community, we left home every day, came to work and fought an unknown disease. Now we're leaving home with another worry. Are we gonna be punched today? Are we gonna be spit on today? Are we gonna be cussed out today? Because now in 2021, Violence against healthcare workers has climaxed. Just a few weeks ago, one of my providers and dear friends was punched in the face by a patient. A patient who was angry that we didn't have results of a CT scan that we didn't even order. Guys, violence against healthcare workers has to stop. We can't take care of you all if we're broken. We're working tired, we're working hungry, we're working emotionally devastated by watching all that's going on around us. The last thing we need is for patients, the very people that we come to work every day to take care of, to be violent. I am a wife. I am a mother. I am a daughter. I am a sister. I am an auntie. I am a father. I am a friend. I am a son. And I am somebody. 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 Whoa, what happened to, to your eye, Mom? Did a man punch you? No, baby. One of my patients did. Violence against healthcare workers has to stop, and it has to stop now.